Hey guys, how's it going? I was asked on Twitter to react to two different things from Girl Meets World. So the first thing I'm going to be reacting to is a promo for Season 2, Episode 16 called Girl Meets Cory and Topanga. There was another bay window. This sounds like a good story. Right. Next Friday, write down the one thing in life you consider impossible. You and mom, they're my impossible thing. What are you talking about? Nothing is impossible. What do you do when you know you'll never be as good as your parents? How are they at our age? We should see that for ourselves. May I ask you a personal question? Oh, Tell a good story, right? Oh my god. Oh my god. That is epically awesome. I cannot wait to see that. They're going to go back and see Cory and Topanga when they were kids. And it's going to be flashbacks and it's going to be incredible. That looks amazing. I'm really looking forward to that. The second thing I was asked to react to is episode 15 of series 2 called Girl Meets Farkle. I really hope Minkus makes an appearance in this. <gasps> Minkus! Yes! Farkle genius party. I'm Stuart Minkus. I'm unexceptional. Who does what I Who's say? Who's his wife? Hi, Corey. Yeah. I don't know who she is. Should I know who she is? What? I like her now. She's a lot less scary than she was in high school. Uh-huh. Who was she in high school? Who is this? I hold in my hand the answer to the question everyone's been asking. Is I don't recognize her at all. They just noticed Farkle's a little farkly. I could have told them that. <laughs> They want to see if I have autism. You don't. I did not see that coming. You don't. I might have a type of autism called Asperger's syndrome. You don't. But what is it? It's a disorder that affects a person's behavior. Farkle, when I said that you were a little farkly, what I meant was... I just have to pause it for a second. Wow! You know what? This is what I love about this show and what I loved about Boy Meets World is that they're not afraid to address serious issues. That's amazing. Like, I'm looking forward to see where this goes. Yeah, you behave just like a perfectly normal Farkle. You do. Thought I was a monster just because I was bigger and different than everybody and I handcuffed Shonda to a boathouse? Handcuffed Shonda? Who is she? Well, it never mattered what people said about me. I've always okay, I need to go back and figure out who Minkus' wife is. I don't remember her. That's a good way to go through life, monster. This show continuously amazes me. It's just so deep and so funny and written so well and the actors do a great job. It's just, it's such a good quality show. Honestly, like, those are friendship goals right there. And just the way that they interact with each other and the positive messages that they're giving out there, I love it. There's just so many crap TV shows right now, especially for like young kids that are just so pointless. And you have something like this spreading such a positive message that it's okay to be you. And it's okay, even if you have a disease or something, that your friends will still love you and just all these positive, great, uplifting things and I love it. Plus, I mean, whenever Boy Meets World characters come back, it's the best. So yay, that was an awesome episode. If you guys want me to react to anything else, you can tweet me. My link's in the description box below. Dat Nadia, let me know. All right, I'll catch you guys later. Bye.